Hi there, this is Sean Broderick for Uncommon Wisdom Daily. I strongly believe that silver is going higher. In fact, I'm pretty sure that silver should lead gold for the near future. Today, we're going to look at one of the forces driving silver, and that force is Chinese demand. Take a look at this chart. Silver is linked to many things. This chart from Deutsche Bank shows how silver is climbing along with Chinese imports of the metal. China is the world's third largest user of silver for industrial and jewelry purposes after the U.S. and India. Net imports of silver into China quadrupled in the first seven months of 2010. Chinese imports of silver continue to climb, and that demand alone could send silver to $22 an ounce by the end of this year, according to Deutsche Bank. Looking down the road, I expect demand for silver worldwide to continue to increase. It's not just China. Many forces are coming together, some of which I talked about in my most recent Uncommon Wisdom Daily column. My two-year target for silver is $27 an ounce, and we can always get there sooner rather than later. We're playing this move big time in my premium services. In fact, Crisis Profit Hunter has some positions that are leveraged to the price of silver and are doing very well. If you want the scoop on my silver picks for Crisis Profit Hunter, and you want to see what I'm going to recommend next, you can get the next issue, which comes out soon, as well as four bonus reports by calling 1-800-400-6916. And tell them that Sean sent you. Thanks very much. This has been Sean Broderick for Uncommon Wisdom Daily.